Okay, as you recall, we took this wax band and I showed you how to put in in the uh, sand casting flask and make it wider. So now this is the uh, second video. So what I'm going to do is we will add the vents here. I like to use this really fine uh, steel bar. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to push down and pull back. I like to get them nice and cleaned out. I don't like to go all the way to the uh, mold yet. I'll wait and do that afterwards. I like to use all all of them. Some people just use a couple of them, but I figure, you know, once the metal is uh, down here and it's filled this up, if there's still gases or air that's trapped, uh, I think I have a better chance of getting a good casting if I've used them all. Now let's see, for the rest of this, we could really use something a little thinner like a knife. Want to make sure you go all the way through. You know, the knife actually works great. It cuts right through. Makes a really nice, clean uh, vent. You may have to blow it out. There might be some that fell down. Gonna make sure these are open enough. If you kind of tip the knife, it uh, pushes it a little bit wider. Okay, the next thing here, so we're gonna cast this. The other half is done. We're going to put the two halves together. You want to look down in here and make sure there's no little bits of clay. You want it nice and smooth. I'm going to pull this over. I'll try and get it in the picture really well. This is going to fit down in here. So I'm using two ounces. It's going to be plenty for this. What you'd want to do is you'd want to rate, uh, weigh this either in uh, penny weight or grams and then multiply it. So if I'm using sterling silver, I'm going to say I could multiply that by 10 and then add, say, another um, maybe half ounce for, for the sprue and the button. Okay, yeah, put the plate in. Get my torch going. 
Sorry about that. Everything tipped over. I don't know what happened, but I'm back. Things don't always go perfect, you know. Okay, you want to heat up the tip? Pour it right in there. So we'll wait a minute here. Yeah, if I was thinking, I'd have got a glove, but I, of course, I wasn't thinking, so. What I'll do is I'll just tip this. Just like that, and then we'll take, break that apart. Looks like a very good cast. Look how wide that is. So, if we compare the two, we got another probably millimeter on each side. And really good looking casting. Uh, you want to have good ventilation. But uh, I think that's it. You know, hopefully you guys learned something. And I'll come up with another uh, couple of videos to hopefully teach you something. Alright, that's it. Thank you.